Hey, so I know a lot of people have been having Halo Master Chief Collection matchmaking issues. I know I have, but I've already found a fix that works 100% of the time. So today, I'm going to show everybody my fix for this. So the first thing you need to do is you need to go to your original Xbox and push the eject button. Now as you can see, the disc should be out of your original Xbox. Now what you have to do is you have to put the game in the case. And the third step is to get rid of it, either by GameStop, Amazon, or the good old trash can. Now what you'll have to do is you'll have to turn off your Xbox One. And then what you'll have to do is the next step is a little trickier. But what you now have to do is you have to go around to the back and you have to plug in your Xbox 360. So for example, I'm actually going to plug this up here. And I'm actually going to change the current wiring hookups so I can actually plug in my Xbox 360 into my monitor. So I'm going to edit this out because long story short you don't want to see this. Now that I have your Xbox 360 hooked up, the next step is to turn it on and put your Halo 3 disc in it. Now as you can see, you have to first turn on your console and then you have to sign into Xbox Live. Well this is optional depending on which Halo you're going to play. But then the next step is you're going to have to go into your profile and you're going to have to sign in. Now while this signs in, I'm going to close the disk drive of my Xbox 360. Actually, I'll just wait a little bit for it to, uh... Okay, now that signed me in, you gotta close the disc tray of your Xbox 360 with your Halo 1, your Halo 2, or your Halo 3 disc. And while it loads, and gives you that infamous noisy disc drive, which sounds like a jet engine, you can now be glad that Halo 3 matchmaking will actually work. I mean, really, it will. Don't believe me? Look at this. Social Slayer. Only 373 people online, and look, I can play online. Now, while it looks like it's taking a while at first, as you can see, I can actually get into a lobby right now. And if you don't mind Halo 3, you can also play Halo 2 and Halo 1 this way. They might not have online, but the PC versions not only still have online, but they'll run on nearly anything nowadays. And let's not forget the fact that um, Halo 2 is playable on the 360 as well, as long as you have a hard drive which nearly every 360 owner probably has by now. Look, see, I'm actually in a lobby with players. You can't do this on on the Master Chief Collection. See, I'm playing Halo 3 right now, and it works just fine. So yeah, try this trick. J just get your 360 out, put your Halo disc in, and boom, it works every time. That's the perfect fix to the matchmaking issues.